2K Sports, in association with the PGA Tour, proudly presents the season-long race for the FedEx Cup. Today's coverage of the Players' Championship is about to begin. Pleased you could join us for this third round action. Hi everyone, Luke Elby alongside Rich B. And Rich, this player is trailing. Do they have to really step it up and get it going today? Currently in the top five, so they're having a decent go of it at the moment, but still plenty of golf yet to be played. Let's find out what they have. Can they make that push to get higher up on the leaderboard? Well, it's time for the preamble to be set aside. Let's get into the action. Let's see what kind of Tony sets for himself today. Nicely done. And what's in front of them there, Henny? Yeah, the breeze ruffling their shirt, hitting their back. It's going to be tough to control the distance here. This one looks to be heading towards the green. Wow, what a shot. You know what? That deserves a golf clap. Well, that's a nice way to start, writing a little red number down on the scorecard at the first. I can't ever recall him making a birdie and feeling bad about it. So, yes, birdie on the first, great job. And after that hole, the standings have this player in second place behind Tiger Woods. And they'd be feeling buoyed with confidence after that birdie. Here's a good chance to maintain the momentum. Driver not necessarily required here because you have to shape your tee shot from right to left. And if you're a right-handed golfer, that's not the easiest thing to do. So lefties have a better opportunity, I think, of finding this fairway than most with driver. From there, a second shot over a long bunker to a green that's very narrow, dotted by pot bunkers. Truly is one of the coolest par fives on this layout. Yeah, that was a safe play. And he's down there. You got a read? Firm back up the hill. This will be a good one. Big chance here. Okay, steady now. Oh, what a shame. That would have been a nice one to hold. And a very familiar sight. Tiger Woods on top of the leaderboard. Let's see what happens here at the third hole. Part of three, just 177 yards from the back, but this green is always firm. Be wary of that. Oh, this one's right down the pipe. Oh, that's a lovely looking shot into birdie range here at the third. The putt drops and we're moving on. He's currently in the second position. Let's see what happens here on the fourth. Just a small little twisty par four. Just going to take out a fairway wood, find the fairway, and from there you're going to have a small second shot, probably a wedge. Three distinct sections to this green, the front, the right, and the back left, and all of them have their difficulties when hitting your approach shot into them. However, in my mind's eye, if you find the fairway, you should have a decent look for birdie. No harm, no foul there with that shot. What an opportunity to make a birdie. It's got a chance. And that's their fourth birdie of the day. Trailing by five shots after that hole. to face a par four. 
huge mounding down the left hand side that you want to avoid at all costs the bunker down the right hand side to be fair is not that bad but a little further right of that though that's the water you want no part of it second shot is downhill to a green to be fair that's mostly flat runs from back left to front right but one of the more benign greens on this layout another birdie opportunity coming up for this player it's a good start to the day let's hope they can keep up the good form yeah a quality shot from him he'll be pleased 12 feet to the cup coming up this is their look at birdie Oh, that's a ripper. Our current leader enjoys a five-shot advantage. Lovely momentum for this player after that birdie at the last hole. Keep it rolling. I missed the tree. I thought that was a really cool feature of this hole. You had to flight it underneath the tree back in the day to find the fairway. The bunker down the left-hand side has been expanded quite a bit as the lake on the left-hand side has been added as well. The front part of this green is protected by tall palm trees that will certainly make you think on your second shots. This is a wonderful little par four. Now this is some ball striking. Hitting greens and regulation, it's a thing of beauty. A chance for a birdie if this goes down. Not a bad line, this. Yeah, nice mid-range birdie putt, that one. So no change on the leaderboard for this player after that hole. Next up is this two-shot hole. Difficult par four, 451 yards, water and sand all the way down the left-hand side. Hit it out to the right, find the green with your second, and sprint to the next hole, making four. And the effort, that one. Playing this shot from around 120 yards. That should find the surface. Great shot into the seventh and a chance for birdie. Nearly doesn't get any better than that. Amazing shot. Three feet to go here to the hole. Oh, what a round this is. Seven birdies today. And all of them are chasing Tiger once again as we move to the next. And after a birdie at the last, they take the honor on the hole. Par three, 237 yards in length. A brute, to say the least. It is a tough hole surrounded by bunkers. If you can make three here, you're a happy person. Well, that certainly makes putting a lot easier when you can hit a shot like that. And a fantastic look upcoming. Good look at birdie here. Well, don't mind the look of this. There it is. The leaderboard has them sitting in second place behind Tiger Woods. We've arrived at a par five. Good birdie on the last. What's in store now? Yeah, give yourself a pat on the back. Second shot here on the ninth hole. Looks like they've got the five wood.
What a shot! Almost went in the bucket. Not able to find the green in two, but a bold play. Looking at the caddy, a bit too much club there. You're kidding me. Did he hold that? That chip in for Eagle works eight days a week in my book. Oh, what a shot that was. Why don't we revisit the magic? Now look how they attacked this one. by six shots after that hole. Well, there's some real momentum with this player coming off an eagle at the last. That, didn't you? And Henny, what are you seeing down there? Setting up here from about 145 yards. This one is chewing fiber. Well, take notes, folks. That's how you do it. And as good as they putt, you almost have to guarantee this one. A birdie putt awaits. down it goes let's head to the next our current leader is enjoying a six stroke advantage pegging it up on the 11th hole here par 5 558 yards long avoid the fairway bunkers on the left hand side and you might have a hope of going forward in two however you better be brave and you better know what you're doing because this green will call you out on the second shots if you're not careful Good shot there, Beamer. Second shot here on the 11th. Well, this person displays the power game in pure fashion there. Using the big muscles to get it home in two there. Starts off on a good line. Oh, well home for Eagle. And after that hole, the standings have this player in second place behind Tiger Woods. Here we have it. Try to feed off the Eagle and build on that momentum here. Par 4, 12th, a new design in the last couple of years. Water all the way down the left-hand side, but it's a drivable par 4. Most players will bail out to the right, but the brave ones will take on the green with their tee shots. Twos and threes are easy to come by, but so are fives and sixes if you get it out of position. Don't you love the long ball, Rich? Drive your par four. Is there a few things more thrilling in the game? Oh, what a play. You know that. I love it when players are aggressive. Way to go. What a shot.
That'll sting a bit. Pretty straightforward four-footer coming up here. What a great opportunity here for a look at a birdie. Oh, how about that one? He's currently just in second place. Now it's time to take a look at this 13th hole. So many different levels to this green on the par three, playing 181 yards from the back. You can get it close. You can even make a hole in one, but watch out if you hit in the wrong spot on the green. It'll be difficult to two putt from there. Yeah, good safe shot this one. That should find the surface. Well, that's a great shot. It sets up a birdie look here at the 13th. Luke, nothing gets past you. Yes, this kid is a stud. Surely it's going to. And with that part hold, it's back to back birdies. I like it two in a row. There's no movement on the leaderboard after that hole. It's time to tee off here at the 14th hole. If you hit it down the left-hand side, the golf ball will chase a long way, but you'll be blocked out by some trees. You hit it out to the right, you're going to be on top of a mound, but you'll have a really good idea of what's in front of you. This hole historically plays as one of the toughest ones on the back nine, and it's all because of where that green sits. It sits from right to left with a decent amount of movement in it. It is not straightforward at all. This hole causes players all kinds of problems. Taking aim from about 170 yards. Pretty good win back into the player's face. Yeah, that one's looking good. Now this wind really starting to get up. That was well managed. A well hold, he'll take the birdie. Our leader is up by a whopping six shots now. Now on the tee after a birdie, fired up and ready for more. Players do hit through a shoot off this tee shot, which makes it a little bit simpler, I believe, for the players. Bunker down the right-hand side is no good because you'll have trees blocking you out with your second shot. If you miss it left into the pine straw, now you've got some trees blocking you out there, so finding the fairway is imperative. This green is no fun. You find the center of the green and you might be able to putt every single day, but in all reality, you have to find the correct section in order to give yourself the best look at making a putt. This one's got eyes for the flag stick. Terrific shot into the 15th and a chance for birdie. This putt's about four feet from the hole. Short game has been absolutely fantastic today. Beautiful shot. Trailing by seven after that hole. I'm pretty sure this player will be buoyed by that birdie back at the last. Let's see if they can deliver another one. Fun-filled adventure waits. Find the fairway, and let's see how brave you are. Do you want to take on the second shot and try and knock it on the green? Of course you do, but watch out. Lots of water awaiting a wayward second. Nicely done. Rich Fortune favors the brave at TPC Sawgrass, but no more than here at the 16th. 
you better be confident in what your abilities are because if you get it wrong, you'll find out in a hurry with this second shot here at 16. You miss it right, you're in the drink. You miss it left, you're going to be in some mounds. You can catch a nasty lie, and that's not any place you want to be. It really is a difficult shot from over on the left-hand side, one of the most underrated difficult shots on this golf course. However, if you're brave, find the center of the green, make eagle, life's good. Oh, terrific. What an effort. Tiger Woods back in his familiar spot, currently sitting in the lead as we check the rest of the standings. And an opportunity awaits as they step onto this tee of the par three. When you play here in a practice round, it looks like you could just throw it on there. But when you're in a tournament round, it doesn't even look like it exists. It, the hole changes so much when the tournament starts. That's what I love about it. What a shot. He's hold it. Well, he doesn't get any better now, does it, Look, A one is the smallest number you can have out there. Yeah, let's do this. What an amazing shot. Let's take another look at that one. I mean, what can you say about a shot like this? This was absolute perfection. The leaderboard has them sitting in second place behind Tiger Woods. Quite often the hardest hole in golf, a long par four. It's just one of the most difficult, visually intimidating holes I think you'll ever face in your life. Somehow, try and hit it down the right-hand side of the fairway, keep it out of the rough, and from there, hit it out to the right-hand side of the green somehow, also keeping it out of the rough or that pot bunker short right. Listen, you'd be happy to make five here, that's for sure. Fours are magnificent. Threes are unicorns. They really don't happen that much. It is such a difficult, demanding finishing hole. Probably one of the toughest in championship golf. From around 120 yards here, five shots off the pace. Yeah, tidy looking shot that one. That was special. Running up the birdie putt here. Gets that one to go down and that'll end the day's work. 